Sometimes when you're working on a spreadsheet, you discover that you need to be able to work with just part of the information that you have in a, in a particular cell. Here I've set up a really simple example where you've got a postal code um, set up in the zip plus four format and you want to be able to split it out into just the five digit zip code and the four digit extension. There are a lot of different ways you can approach this situation but today we're going to talk about uh, three different functions left, right, and mid. The left function lets you uh, extract a specific number of characters starting from the left side of a cell. Right lets you extract a number of characters from the right side of a cell. And mid lets you extract a specified number of characters from a midpoint in the cell which you choose. So we'll show you how these work. They're really simple formulas that normally you could just type in, but I'm going to use the wizard here uh, uh, to make it easy to see what we're doing. So if we just type in left, here's our function wizard text. Um, we're going to use a cell reference here. We want the text that's in cell A2. And the number of characters we want is 5. So we can see that gives us just the first 5. And over here, we'll go to the function wizard again. Right. And we want the same cell. This time we only want four characters. So if we fill those down, we can see we easily get just exactly what we're looking for. Now, your data may not be this neat. Maybe it looks more like this down here where people have been consistent with how they entered it. If we copy these formulas down here, you'll see that we've got a problem in that in our plus four area, we now have mostly garbage because these are completely useless because of the way they were formatted. And again, there's a lot of ways you can approach this, but we're going to talk about using the mid function here. So if we go back to the function wizard, and we'll use mid, our text is still going to be that cell. Our starting number, we've got five characters of the zip code, plus the dash would be six, so we want to start on the seventh character. So starting number is seven, and we want four characters just like we did before. We'll click OK, and then we'll fill that down. And so you see now, we're only getting results where there's a good plus four extension on there. So it doesn't matter that we don't have as many characters. Here there isn't even a seventh character in that cell. That's okay. We'll just end up with uh, you know, with no result over here.